munch Nigga, eat it, he ate it for lunch Tell my baddie I get what I want like You thought I was feeling you? No, I was feeling you That nigga munch Nigga, eat it, he ate it for lunch Tell my baddie I get what I want like Get what I want Now let's keep it a bean Wanna be mad, I'll be on the scene Ask too if I can't fit no G Use my stitch, but it's not what I'm saying hey y'all welcome back to my channel if you are subscribed if you're not subscribed welcome to my channel go ahead and subscribe while you're here in this video we are going to be super productive we're going to be crossing things off my to-do list and getting sh done so if y'all need some motivation or you just want to be productive with me stay tuned okay so y'all um i literally just got off work and i came home because i need to change my clothes and then i'm heading right back out actually so let me get my phone because babe when i tell you the to-do list is long it's so long so i know i'm not gonna be able to get every single thing done today but i'm trying to get as much things as i can get done today today and then i move the stuff that i can't get done today to tomorrow so i'm gonna try and accomplish everything on this to-do list between today and tomorrow because saturday i have some appointments and then i'm going on a trip so i'm trying to make sure that i get all this stuff done before i leave because i don't want to be on vacation and having to worry about things or trying to like do things like i just want to enjoy and relax so i'm trying to get this stuff done before i start preparing and going on my trip so my to-do list is really really long the first thing i had to do was pick up packages from the post office i already did that just now but honestly um i still have packages coming in like later on tonight and tomorrow so i'm gonna wait i think until i get all my packages to give you like a little unboxing haul but um i do got a bunch of packages to show y'all i have to change into some workout clothes because i didn't go to workouts today at 5 a.m i literally went to bed so late last night y'all like after 11 and i wake up at 4 so i was like it's no way i'm gonna make it to workouts i'll just go to the evening class today so that's what i'm gonna do um i have to take out something to cook because i said i'm going to cook tonight i have a doctor's appointment at 4 it's currently 3 30 um me and my mama are gonna go look at some furniture because she convinced me that i need a new bedroom set so we found one online that i like we're gonna go look at it in person to see if it's still giving what i wanted to give and if i like it then i guess we're gonna go ahead and order it uh, i did get my tax money so i need to deposit my checks and distribute them wherever they need to go at so we gotta go to the bank i gotta go to cvs to pick up um a photo order it's basically something for noah's birthday party um i want to go to dollar general that's not really like something that i need to do but if i'm trying to kill time because basically like my appointment is going to be from four to probably five o'clock and then the workout class is at six so between five and six i need to just find stuff to do and i'm not gonna go get something to eat so i need to be finding something productive to do so if i have time i'll go to dollar general but if not it's not that big of a deal and then like i said i gotta go to my workout and cook and then um i also when i walked in i seen that i have laundry that i need to put up so i need to do that as well tomorrow i want to go to this local coffee shop because it's actually like spring break right now for my school district and so they're letting us off like early every day so so far we get off at three but tomorrow we get off at 12. so i never can make it to the coffee shop because they're always they don't open until after i be at work but because i'm getting off so early tomorrow i'm gonna try and go when i get off work so i'm gonna go to the coffee shop get a little latte or something and then i want to do some editing because like i said i'm trying to make sure that i have all my work done before i go on vacation vacation so i need to finish up a video i need to plan out like videos and all these events and stuff coming up next month i need to plan and make sure i'm prepared for everything yeah like i said we are going to be very 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 busy so let's go ahead and get right into it like i said my doctor's appointment is in less than 30 minutes and i'm not even dressed yet so i actually am already dressed but i'm gonna put on my workout clothes because i'm not coming back home after my appointment so i'm gonna show you what i'm gonna put on okay y'all so i'm gonna put on this little three-piece set that i got from forever 21 i did show it to y'all in one of my videos it's like this little pullover sports bra and some leggings and it's like really nice and seamless so yeah this should be good and it should be nice for the weather because y'all this weather bipolar it's delusional one minute it's sunny and then the winter blow and then it'll feel cold and then it's like raining and then it's like sunny again like i just can't keep up with it so i feel like with this even if it rain i'm good because this has a hood and i can take the jacket off if i'm hot but i can keep it on i ain't gonna i like to go to my workouts in my jacket and then start sweating and then take it off because i feel like the jacket help you sweat more but yeah so i'm about to put on my clothes and then like i said i gotta take out some food for dinner and then i gotta get my check so i can i gotta remember to get my check too so i can cash it i think that's one of the things i gotta do before i leave my house i just gotta make sure i do not want to forget something yeah that's one of two things i gotta do before i leave so i'm out of change and then i'll come back to y'all before i leave or when i'm on the way yeah i'm dressed y'all and i love this outfit i knew i was gonna like it but baby it's so cute on it's t y'all tell me it's not cute it took me three pairs of underwear to find something that wasn't gonna show but this is so cute and this is with my body not even all the way like you know yet but this is so cute you can see the tag right there it'll look better like you can see my little fupa right there but it's so cute when i get my body like all the way good oh babe it's gonna be so cute i'm like mom take my picture because i look so cute in this set i love it i'm just scared about the color because it's so light i'm like i'm definitely gonna mess this up but even the jacket is fitting good and this is like a medium so 
yeah and it covered my stomach perfectly like and i think it's gonna have good support and not slip down so i love this little set i'm like obsessed with workout sets right now even before i was working out i was buying a lot of workout sets but now i'm actually working out in them now i feel like i have more of an excuse to buy workout sets yeah i'm about to go ahead and head out i don't know this lighting is crazy i didn't try to talk to y'all like two times but the lighting don't be looking good so i don't move my parking spot hoping that it'll be better lighting but it's like a shadows in my face half my face is in the sun half of it's not so i'm just gonna talk to y'all like this all right y'all so i went to my daughter's appointment it really wasn't too much to talk about there because it was supposed to be a checkup for an appointment that I had months ago but then he had to reschedule so now I'm seeing him and it's like baby I was sick months ago like of course I'm fine by now and then y'all we went to the furniture store and I was like oh I need to pull my camera baby it was no reason to pull my camera the set that we went in there for not only did they not have the set that we went in there for but when we went to like go and order it she's like oh we don't like have that we don't have access to it like it's a dropped set and we can't order it like you can only go to the stores that have it in stock and get it from there so that was a Bust, but I'm glad I didn't waste my time trying to vlog in there. But yeah, so now we at CVS because this is the other errand that I had to run. I also need to go and cash my checks, but the bank closed by the time that we went to the furniture store. So I'm just going to cash my checks tomorrow when I get off work. I still got to pick up the CVS order. So we outside CVS right now. I'm about to pick up this stuff for Noah's party. It's 517 and my workout is at 6. So I might have time to go to Dollar General still. But yeah, we finna pick up Nova's order and then um I'll probably see y'all at Dollar General or when I'm outside my workout. Yeah. All right, y'all. So... We um, picked up Novi's prints from CVS, but y'all, these prints is not, one of them is the right size, but the rest of them are not the right size because it's like a different orientation, so they're a lot smaller than I wanted it to be, but I think I'm just gonna make it like that anyways, and they'll just be like smaller than I want them to be, and I'm just gonna have to live with it because I'm not finna pay for more. Them things are like $11 a piece, and I bought like, for it's so almost fifty dollars for a piece of paper basically but yeah so we're gonna go in here i'm just gonna see if i can find little cute decorations for her party i'm really not going in here look for anything specific i'm just trying to kill time it is 5 30 though and i'm excited because i've been wanting to try this out for the longest y'all so one of the packages that i have picked up today was my pre-workout i hope eph or yeah ehp i hope that they are running miss beta her coins because i've seen so many people get the pre-workout just because of her like she did her big one with that um sponsorship i worked out before and everything but i've never been this consistent and i really want to take my health seriously so i was looking to get into things like pre-workout and protein powder so when i seen that promotion i was like yeah that's literally perfect so i got the oxy shred thermogenic fat burner i got the passion fruit flavor because i seen kai said she didn't like the kiwi strawberry and i just feel like passion fruit would be better anyways i hope this don't want caffeine in it because i need some caffeine it don't say if it's caffeine or not but i think this is the one caffeine but yeah this is how it looks so i'm finna fix my protein um protein drink whatever or pre-workout what am I talking about? You can tell I don't know what I'm doing. But yeah, so I waited to do it because I looked up online and it said that you're supposed to do it 30 to 60 minutes before your workout and it's literally 534. So I feel like this is the perfect time. But I be seeing people take it right before they work out and that's what I meant to do. But I had to look it up and it said to do otherwise. And I got a water with me so I can mix it. I don't know how much water I'm supposed to do, but I just hope this shit tastes good, y'all. Really hope it tastes good. Oh, I didn't even tell y'all. Miss Girl's in the back with me because i didn't know my mom had to work but she does oh it smell good but yeah my mom had to work so novi is with me now and um she gonna cut me to my workout i probably shouldn't do this in my car but you gotta do what you gotta do and i already had this bottle so i ain't even had to buy it Ooh, yeah i definitely shouldn't do this in my car i probably should have started drinking this at like five o'clock though because i'm probably not gonna finish this in 30 minutes especially if it's nasty i might just pour as much water that'll fit in here oh it do have measurements on the side i'm just gonna do 10. it smells so good though i feel like it's gonna taste so good yeah it says of 10 ounces of cold water 10 minutes before exercise do not consume after 5 p.m y'all this thing say do not consume after 5 p.m bye because i'm about to do it anyways y'all why say that that scared me <laughs> What if I can't go to sleep tonight? Oh, I ain't even shook it up. What am I doing? She shook it. I cannot believe I'm like deliberately disobeying the directions and finna drink this after five. Why y'all say that after five? Because now I'm scared. What? It's not nasty, but it got a weird aftertaste. Like, I don't know. I can taste the passion fruit, but it got a weird aftertaste. But it's drinkable. I can definitely drink this. I'm not gonna drink the whole thing though, I don't think, because it said not to drink it after 5 p.m. So I feel like I shouldn't drink the whole thing. That's crazy. 
I'm actually crazy. Because why did I literally just disobey what it said? But anywho, yeah. So we're going to see if this helped me have energy and help me have a better workout. I felt like low energy at work. And I already had my coffee. And I just don't like to drink two coffees in a day. So I'm hoping that that'll give me the boost that I need. But yeah, we're going to go on Dollar General. And then I'll meet y'all for my workout. And y'all, I'm so excited because this is going to be my first workout with my Apple Watch. Check her out. I've had this Apple Watch for literal years and I only used to use it in high school to like text in class. But after that, I just didn't use it anymore. But now that I'm working out, I was like, oh my God, I want to use my Apple Watch. But literally y'all, I've been trying to get this thing to work since like last Monday or Tuesday. It was like, oh, your phone need an update. Your Apple Watch need an update. Like it was always something going wrong, but I finally got it working this morning so I can actually track my workout. So I'm super excited about that. But yeah, we finna go in the store and I'll probably meet y'all when we um finna get this workout in, okay? Are you recording yourself? Yes, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> as long as you record me. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Young girl, no one that back calling me splurge. Let me jump right out the curb. Yeah. Bentley spread fly like a bird. Spin on the first and the third. Yeah. Solid, I'm keeping my word. Can't be my equal, I don't know what you heard. Yeah. Crack up the four and I swear. Keep me a stick if they purge. Young girl, no one that they working my nerves. I'm about to pull us a surge. Fucking this bitch like a perm. Smack on the back of a perm. Ice, the bird. Uh, Shitting on all you little turds. Can't take that dick with your turn. In my own life, we can't merge. So, with no hands, you can learn. Let's see how much you can earn. Why me go big like the worm? And I ain't smoking no shirt. I'm gonna be with Pete Keep me, keep me I love my bitches, it's pretty. They showing their titties, it's up to the ceiling. I let them run through a me and I rock with a really Let's fuck on the bay. I'ma get down to the gritty, then fuck up the city, the home of the villains. It's a C1 and fulfilling. Smoke out the pound when I'm chilling. Trapping, I made me a killer. Look, I got everybody wishing. I hope you play your position. I don't want nobody listening. I see the whole position. All right, y'all. I'm back from the gym. That workout was good. It was giving sweated out Saturday, but it was actually stuff it up Thursday. But it was a good workout. Um, Novi was being Nova, so I had to do some of the workouts with her, but... I got such a good sweat y'all like i'd be wishing low-key that we didn't stretch sometimes because if i would like stop working out and not stretch you would see like my face drenched in sweat but by the time like we you know stretching everything it kind of like set in so you don't get to see it but yeah that was a good little workout but i'm really like disgusting now let me show my pants can y'all see it yeah you see the stain i got stains all on my pants because when i was taking stuff out the trunk my car is really dirty so it messed up my set and i knew it was gonna get messed up i'm glad i took pictures in this before um it got messed up but yeah so me and Noe finna take a shower because we're both really disgusting and then i'm gonna go ahead and make dinner i just want to tell you how good my workout was because it really was superb and i'm glad that i went ahead and got my workout in because even though i didn't do it this morning that don't mean that oh, i'm just gonna you know throw the whole day away like no as so long as you got time you got opportunity. So I went ahead and did my little late workout. That's what I do when I miss my morning workouts. I try to go in the afternoon. Because I really don't want to go a day without working out. Unless it's like a really valid reason. You know what I'm saying? I'm really trying to be consistent. So yeah, I'm glad I did that. And I only work out four days a week. So I feel like the least I can do is show up Monday through Thursday. Friday through Sunday, I let myself have it. But Monday through Thursday, I like to show up and show out. You know what I'm saying? So my camera my camera battery had died. So y'all didn't see like we did glute bridges. And then we did like taps and um, alternating knee grabs i guess with the glute bridges but we was doing a sumo squat one time and baby i caved i could not do it i could not hold that thing like my legs are burning so bad and i'm pretty sure i'm gonna be sore tomorrow but that's good soreness is good okay but yeah so i'm finna go ahead and take a shower and i will see y'all whenever i'm finna cook dinner i still don't know exactly what i'm gonna cook yet i know it's gonna be like chicken i don't know if i'm gonna do chicken with nacho cheese tacos chicken with tostados or chicken with like i don't know but it's gonna be something chicken and mexican so yeah, I'm gonna see y'all whenever we get ready to cook. I forgot to tell you about the pre-workout. So y'all know I didn't drink that much. And I don't know if like it got in my head. But I swear like the first like 10 minutes of the workout. Nova wasn't even being bad for real. I'm usually good at like jungling Nova in the workout. So like my head was like not cooperating. It was songs that we've done before. And I was messing up. And I was like, is it the pre-workout? And I don't know if it was or not. I already have anxiety. I do not need to be adding on to my stress. So hopefully that was just a one-time thing. And I was just jumbled up up here. And it wasn't actually the pre-workout. But I did not like that feeling. But I can say like, you know, I did good with my workout. Even though I was tired and everything, I still like did pretty well. So 
I don't know. The jury's still out on that, but I just want to tell you that because right now it's getting a side eye. Like, I don't know about you. And if I don't like it and I spend all that money on it, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I can give it away to somebody, but it's like, that's $60. That's not a little gift you just give away. You know what I'm saying? But let me take a shower and then I'm gonna see y'all whenever we start cooking. They say time here. This boy Anthony right here, he said, listen. Off on the bricks, we got a whole lot of bricks, you got a whole lot of tricks, and I want to see what you do. Ain't that you been all this in, he ain't me. If I ever made you angry, girl, just know that it get better every time. Best kept secret. They say time is, she can't see her life. All right, y'all. I don't know why her dang bonnet keep coming off, but I'm done cooking. I decided to make um like taco salad, but do it with chicken instead of beef. Cause I don't know. That's like I feel like when I do it with beef, it be too heavy on my stomach, and I just don't like that feeling. I'm really thinking I'm about to cut beef out, y'all. Cause like beef just be so heavy, and I don't like it. I don't feel like beef is like worth eating, if that makes sense. So. Yeah, I made it with chicken. I'm going to try it out for y'all. I don't have any tomatoes, so I just use salsa. And then I thought I had bought shredded lettuce, but I didn't. So I just used some romaine lettuce and cut it up as best as I could. Trying to find a show to watch. I feel so, like, lost, y'all. Love is Blind is not on anymore. I've been watching um Abbott Elementary and Not Dead yet. But I need, like, a show that I can binge watch. And I can't binge watch either one of those. So I just be looking stupid. <laughs> I literally be putting on stuff on over, like, I'm putting on Family Guy because that's something both of us can kind of enjoy. But if y'all got any good, like, shows that I can binge watch on Netflix or Hulu, let me know because I need something to watch. Like, it's nothing like when you have a good meal and you have something good to um, watch it with. Oh, it's a, it's a match made in heaven. But before my TV come on, I'm about to go ahead and find a good piece so I can try it for y'all. It's literally, um chip like dorito chips i get the flaming hot lettuce chicken i put salsa jalapenos and yeah it's just like a little salad but with tacos or taco toppings all right this is my little chip hmm. don't do me my food is actually good i'm looking because who was like we got other our payment method leave me alone <laughs> but no it's actually good and i feel like because i did chicken I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna be able to eat more of this. So I think my theory was right. Not me talking about sour cream in my face. But yeah, so I'm about to find something to watch and I'm probably finna eat. I'm thinking about making cookies. So if I do make cookies, I'll come back to like bake cookies with y'all. But if not, I'll probably see y'all tomorrow because I'm really not finna do too much. But eat, go to sleep. I don't think I'm gonna do anything else productive. I was thinking about editing or like start prepping some of Nova's birthday stuff. But honestly, y'all, it's already what? 849. So I doubt I'll do that. But if I do, I'll come back and let y'all know. If not, I'll see y'all tomorrow. I didn't even talk to y'all yet. I just jumped straight into the editing session, but um, I came to this local coffee shop. I've only been here one time before and I've been wanting to come, but it's like they only open when I'm at work. But since I got off early today, I was like, I'm gonna come. I meant to start working on this video, but I'm actually behind with my other videos. So I was gonna try and finish it, but like literally I'd be overthinking every single little thing. So I still didn't finish the video, but I did get a lot of work done. So I'm gonna go home. I'll finish it whenever I get home, but I do have some errands that I still need to run because y'all know yesterday, oh, my phone's dead. Um, but yeah, y'all know yesterday, um, I didn't even make it to the bank, so I'm gonna run to the bank today, and then I also need to get gas, because my, um, car is on E, so I'm gonna go do that. I think that's the only other errands I need to run, and then I'm gonna go home. I should have some more packages there as well. Yeah, just a quick little catch-up. The coffee shop was nice. I don't know, I just love editing, and, like, coffee shops and libraries, I just feel like I can focus so much better and just be, like, a vibe, but... 
yeah so i'm finna go cash these checks and get some gas and then i'll meet y'all back at home all right y'all so it's been a few days which will explain why my lashes look a little bit fuller why my hair is different i started filming this vlog and i told y'all i was trying to get a lot of things done before i went on my trip and baby i wasn't able to get everything done before the trip i did everything that i needed to get done before the trip but there were some things that i still didn't get to finish so i came back from my trip and i still am on my productive stuff um this is literally my last few days before i go back to work so i'm like let me keep keep the energy going and continue to be productive and since i just got back from my trip i have a lot to do even though i cleaned up before i left i have a lot of laundry that i have to put up i have to unpack our suitcases and i just have to get everything back together and kind of get back into a routine so that's what we're going to be doing today today is friday april 5th and yeah so it's literally like two o'clock right now but i spent all morning editing my maintenance vlog so that I can go out for y'all today and right now i'm trying to get ready so i'm trying to do two things at once or kind of three things at once i'm trying to review my video so watch it make sure it looks good put up some laundry and i'm trying to get ready because i'm going to the gym in a little bit i'm going to be going to the gym with zay's daddy because um i did not feel like waking up at 6 a.m this morning to go do yoga and i wanted something that was a little bit more intense anyway so i'm gonna go to the gym with zay's daddy and get a little workout in there so so yeah, I'm trying to get some things done before that. And then at three o'clock, I have a therapy session. So maybe it's a whole lot going on, but I'm trying to be as productive as possible. I've already said like after today, I'm not, it's not that I'm not going to be productive, but I'm just going to be more focused on having fun. So I'm trying to make sure I get everything done today. All right, y'all. So I realized I did not turn on this light. Why did I forget to turn the light? All right, so as far as everything that I didn't finish doing last week, the only things that I didn't really do was show y'all my packages and plan for the month. So that's all that we're going to be doing today. I have a therapy appointment in about 20 minutes, so I'm going to try to put up as much laundry as I can before that comes. And then I also want to go ahead and review my video before I upload it just to make sure that it looks good. And then I'm going to have my therapy session. And then after my therapy session, I'm going to drop Nova off, go to the gym. And then when I come back home, I guess that's when I plan and show y'all packages and stuff. I know I don't have enough time to do it now because I'm literally rushing, but I'm about to just go ahead and try and clean up my room. Even though I cleaned my room before I left, it's a little bit messy because I have a lot of laundry to put up and all these packages. So I'm finna try and go ahead and tidy up in here right fast and then we'll get into everything else. <laughs> so i made it back home i didn't tell y'all but i didn't end up changing what i had on because i really do like that jumpsuit but i'm on my period and you can see my underwear and i just did not feel comfortable wearing that plus you can see my back rows i'm like let me wait until i feel a little bit more confident or at least i'm off my period to wear that so i changed into like a little sports bra and some little um like yoga pants but i got back from my workouts i've been done with my workouts but i went to go get nova and stuff so it's been a little while i do need to take a shower y'all but i cannot stand like getting all fresh and clean and then cleaning up so i'm just gonna stay in my sweaty workout clothes while i go ahead and unpack my stuff and clean up my room i'm pretty much done with putting up my laundry because i did that before i left but i have a few things i need to hang up like my work clothes and stuff so i'm gonna do that right now and then i'm gonna go ahead and start unpacking our stuff y'all i was so overwhelmed like leaving the house i was literally trying to do too much at one time i was on my therapy call trying to pack up the car so i could get ready to go to the gym and drop off nova love my ipad because my ipad was supposed to be uploading my video while i was gone completely forgot that i fell down the stairs with nova trying to hurry up and rush and get out of the house but it just was a lot y'all and then i was trying to like put up laundry and film this video and it was just too much so i feel a little bit better now because the things that were like time like the workout and my therapy call those things are done so now i can use the rest of my day to finish get my life together because i have a busy weekend ahead of me but it's like a fun weekend so I want to make sure that I can really have fun. So I'm trying to make sure I get everything done today. I don't want to keep dragging this out. So yeah, I'm out to finish clean up my room and then go ahead and start unpacking. I don't know what I'm eating for dinner. I was going to drive and get Chipotle, but it's like so late. It's almost eight o'clock. Recently, I've been noticing like I'm not into the same foods I used to like. Not even on no like it came naturally. Like it wasn't like I'm forcing myself to stop eating things that I like, but it's like some things that I used to love to eat. It's just like cringe to me now. Like I just don't want to eat it. Like even hot stuff. Like I love spicy hot stuff, but it's like my body is rejecting it. And I think it's like, I know how hard I work. So I don't want to do 
do it anymore but some things literally like i want to say disgust me now but it's just like i'm not attracted to anymore it's not appealing to me anymore so i've been trying to stick away like i've been eating fried foods and stuff but it's like it hasn't been hitting the same so i think i want something fresh tonight because i kind of had like a heavy like brunch so i think i want something like light and fresh tonight but i don't know but like literally i can feel myself and my body changing it's so crazy especially because y'all know me i love to eat like i love to eat so i'm welcoming the changes because i know it's gonna be better for me and my body and my overall health so yeah but i just had to tell you that so i'm gonna go ahead and finish cleaning up and then i'm gonna take a shower and then we're gonna find something to eat but i just want to give y'all an update okay <laughs> all right y'all so i've been spending the last few hours unpacking clean up my room i didn't really show out everything because i felt like i just did a reset and i just showed y'all me packing so it didn't really make no sense for me to show y'all me unpacking plus it wasn't like i was just in one spot i was literally moving around trying to put everything up but I vacuumed my rug, um, I put away all the laundry, unpacked all of our bags, hung up some clothes, wiped off, you know, my little nightstand and part of my dresser. So we are all nice and clean now. So I feel really good about that. I'm about to finally show y'all all the packages that I kept talking about. Um, it's kind of a good thing that I waited to show y'all because some things, some things still haven't come in, but um, other things have come in since the last time I talked to y'all. So now I can give y'all like a full unboxing haul. And this is all the stuff that I have to show y'all. We have a lot of packages, so I'm gonna do a little unboxing haul and show everything that i got i have things for work i have things for a wedding that's coming up i have things for working out things for productivity a little bit of everything most of the stuff from amazon but i have some packages from macy's um a brand called i think baby boo um fashion nova all the things so let's go ahead and get into it so i'm just gonna start from the top and work my way down so this um is a package from amazon actually i seen this um lady i think her name is nikki on tiktok i love her content she's like a cleaning organizing tiktoker and i don't know what it is but every time she show her little water bottle i'd be so obsessed with it so it's so freaking cute y'all it's basically shaped like a stanley cup but it's clear and i feel like that's so aesthetically pleasing so i got mine but of course i had to get in my favorite color which is tiffany blue so I'm trying to get the straw out but it does come with the straw so we love that but this is the cup so like i said i got blue so it has like little blue accents it has what is this i think it's like a cover or something and then it has a blue tip for the straw and then it comes with like a little cleaning brush and then it also comes with this uh what is this cork bamboo top so i love that because i honestly do be needing more than one top and then it also has like a little straw topper so we love that um i just been dying to get this because i don't know every time she fills up her little cup it's looking so cute and aesthetically pleasing so yeah i wanted to pick one up i just feel like this would be so cute for like when i'm at home and like i have a, enough water cups but i feel like when i'm making like mixed drinks like when i'm making my boba or if i'm doing like a little olipop situation i want a cute cup so that's really why i got that for but it came with a lot of stuff and it was on like i don't remember how much it was but i feel like i got a good deal so yeah i think it's super cute super aesthetically pleasing next package this is from belt these are my boots for nova's birthday party if you are unaware um novi is having like a barn themed birthday party so i needed some cowboy boots and i got these like white suede ones these were on clearance at belk um i thought they were gonna be different material but honestly i really don't care i just want them for the look i'm only gonna probably wear these like once and never again so i'm not too mad i'm gonna make sure that they fit though they fit but they kind of tight fit so i probably wear these with no socks my little zara boots that i wear like every other day i saw this tip to like wear your boots with no socks gonna be a lot more comfortable and that's what i've been doing and they are a lot more comfortable so i'll probably just wear those without socks next package is kind of heavy oh it's from fenty so um i have ordered some stuff from the fenty sale um miss kyrie doing her thing because if it wasn't for her i would never know when that sale is and i probably would always miss it so i got a few products i'm kind of upset because i seen that some of the stuff that i bought was on sale at um sephora and i could have got two for the same price but it's okay i think i only got what four things so yeah that's everything but the packaging is so cute we love that riri we love that the main two things that i got was the fenty perfume body cream oh i messed up the box already but we love how it's blue right i got the body cream and the matching perfume and really i got this for the wedding that i was talking about i'm only gonna use this on like special occasions so like that wedding i was telling you i'm gonna go to i think i'm gonna use it for that i have no idea how this smells i literally just got it because kyra said it smells good so kyra don't leave me wrong 
Oh, this do smell good. I'm trying to, I got a perfume that smells a lot like this. So it smells very rich. It has like a little musk scent to it. Definitely not for every day. So I'm glad that I bought it with the, intention, with the intentions of only wearing it a few times. Yeah, it smells good. I don't know, is it worth the hype? I don't know. I was kind of hoping for something a little bit more unique being that I have a perfume that smells like that and that perfume is pretty inexpensive. Let me see how the actual perfume bottle. It feel like it ain't full all the way, Riri. Yeah, so it's like very masculine to me. Very masculine, very strong, but I feel like it'll be a good little scent for the wedding. I probably will add something else to it though, just to make it a little bit more sweet and feminine since I'm gonna be all dressed up and girly, but that's really what I want to get from the sale because I've seen it was on sale and I've been wanting to try that perfume for the longest. So finally went ahead and bought it. Then I had got another, um, can y'all see this Fenty plush pudding? I love mine that I have right now. I have like the green one, which is melon and has glitter in it. I love it to death. It's so convenient and I just love it. And I feel like it lasts long, so I had to pick me up another one since they were having a sale. And then the last thing that I got, this is so small, is the Ultra Hydrating Cherry Balm. It's really, really, really small. Like, I don't know why I thought it was gonna be so much bigger, but I feel like this would be great to like keep in my car. Cause like, sometimes I just want something on my lips, but I don't necessarily want like a gloss. So I feel like this would be like something chill that I could put on. I definitely smell the cherries. Um, I already have some on my lips, so I can't really test it out for y'all. But yeah, so that was everything that I had picked up from Rihanna. And then she also had like, if you spend a certain amount, you can get a free little bag. So I had got this little tote bag. I was planning to take it on my trip but um i didn't like unbox the stuff yet but it's called the getaway bag and i love how it has like so many i just love the storage in it so it has like this little bottom part oh baby this is cute so it has like a part where you can put stuff in it has different compartments which we love if i was a makeup girly i'd be eating this up but i still am and i'm not a makeup girl and then i just love the color it's like nice and pink and like a little blush and then at the top, it's just like a little structured bag. It also has pockets in there. So yeah, and it has a little zipper pocket. This was great, especially for it to be cheap. We love it. And it has a little handle that also says, I don't know if y'all can see it, but the handle says Fenty Beauty. And I feel like that just makes it even more convenient. So yeah, I'm really glad that she offered that. All right, next package. So I wish that these came like a week earlier. I did get some underwear for working out just because I don't know, I feel like when I'm in the gym, I want something seamless so you can't see it, you know, with my leggings and stuff because I usually wear tight things. I want something breathable because I'm sweating and I want something that's gonna like moisture wick. So I got these little seamless breathable thongs for working out. These had really good reviews. And I have like little Hanes panties with the little hole so that you can breathe. So I feel like I really like these. Um, This was like a five pack, I think. So I got white, nude, black, light gray, and navy so i feel like this should be enough this plus my other underwear should be enough to get me through my workouts i literally wish it came like a week earlier so i could actually use them but now i'm on period so i will not be wearing those but those are going to be really good since i'm starting to work out and i just want to be comfortable and everything next thing so this is the dress that i'm actually going to be wearing to the wedding i do already have my shoes if i remember i'll show them to y'all if not y'all just have to wait to see so this dress y'all i literally went back and forth so many times about what type of dress i wanted what color i wanted and everybody seems to really like this one so it's basically like a corset dress. I'm not gonna give too much away, but this is really, really pretty like rust auburn color. Wow, this color on my skin is going to eat the fuck down. Um, But it's like midi, but it has like a slit and I think it's gonna be so cute. I got this from a brand called Baby Boo, which I've never shot with before, but I feel like this was the perfect mix of like classy, um, still a little sexy and elegant. So hopefully it looks as good on me as it looked on the model because that is the whole reason why I bought it. Okay, all right, next thing that I got, this is something I'm gonna for so long and i just been procrastinating to buy so this is an ipad stand my ipad case actually had a stand on it but i broke it so i was like okay let me go ahead and bite the bullet and buy ipad stand i just feel like this is gonna be so good because i be editing on my ipad mostly so this would just help me with like my neck and stuff because literally i'm always like looking down editing and it hurts my neck so this is gonna be so much better like i can literally just like go like this so yeah i got this from amazon next package is from macy's i think these are my just couture flats basically y'all some shoes that i have been wanting for work had went on sale so i was like okay i have to get them and while i was looking i seen a few other things that caught my eye literally like three nothing too serious so first thing that i got were some juicy couture flats if y'all are new here i love juicy couture stuff me and my mama do so i pick up these little new ballerina flats i love them because they have like a little charm at the front with the bow and they have rhinestones all over them and my little silver pair juicy couture flats are getting pretty tired so i picked up a new pair of flats to wear to work and i actually don't have any any new shoes at all so i feel like that was the best of both worlds so yeah i picked those up so yeah like i said um i seen these shoes like 
probably a few months ago and I really liked them but I just felt like they were too expensive so I waited I was gonna get them from Amazon but I seen that Macy's had them on sale so I was like let me go ahead and get these shoes hopefully they fit y'all so basically there are some loafers and I still want a pair of like black and gold loafers but these are just so freaking cute to me and I love that they're from a good brand so I know that they'll last me a long time these are just some silver little loafers from coach and they're like metallic and I don't know I thought like they'd be so cute and just kind of go everything and I just love the vibe of these I feel like the heel and everything looks good every time I try to find loafers they either be like something wrong with it It'd be too much going on not enough going on the heel be too high like it just always be something but I feel like these are a really perfect pair and I don't know I thought like they're gonna be comfortable so I'm glad that I finally picked these up and and then the last thing that I had picked up from Macy's, I don't know if I was trying to reach a total or what because I literally, I don't know. But I had picked up these little like cream pants um, that would be good for work. I'm trying to get more loose fitting pants because sometimes y'all, my boss be like, your pants are too tight. So I got these so that she could not say that they were too tight. They're like a beige off-white color and I feel like they'll go with a lot. So yeah, that's why I picked these up. All right, y'all. So the last package is from Fashion Nova. And um, it's just like a few outfits that I have bought for some events that I have coming up. Now, I know that unfortunately some of these outfits I can't, well, at least one of them, I can't even wear for what I bought it for. But, but I'm still going to show y'all. So first thing that I got was this really cute star cowboy hat. I love anything with stars because I feel like that just goes with Nova's name. So I got this. Oh, they sent it all bent up. But I got this for Nova's party. It literally has stars right here. And I feel like it's so cute. And Fashion Nova actually had it cheaper than Amazon. So I was like, okay, Fashion Nova it is. And I was hoping it would go with the boots. But I feel like this is like low key a perfect match. So I'm so happy that they match each other. And it's going to be a look. And then to go with my cowboy boots and my cowboy hat. It's giving either return or wear somewhere else. Um, so this is gonna be my outfit for Nova's party. On camera, I feel like it looks lighter, but in person, I'm like, baby, it was supposed to be like way lighter than this. I don't know. It'll look so cute though. Okay, I'm gonna keep it, but I do wish it was lighter. I might sit this out in the sun to see for the dry up a little bit. But basically, it's just like this little rumper and it has like a little tie detail in the front, which I love because I feel like that definitely gives like cowgirl farm vibes. But um, I love that it's a rumper, so I ain't gotta worry about you know something showing. I feel like this would be good to like walk around and it's like cute. But since I'm doing too much, like I just love it. I just wish it was a little bit lighter, but. So I bought this really, really, really cute dress because I thought I was gonna be wearing it tomorrow, but it's actually gonna be cold, so I won't be able to wear it. So I guess it'll just become part of my summer wardrobe, but it's this really cute, like pink tiered dress. I usually don't wear stuff like this, but I was going to like some events. So I was like, okay, this would be really cute and dressy and give all the vibes. But like I said, it's gonna be too cold to wear, but I already know exactly how I wanna style this and everything. And I feel like the color is so beautiful. So yeah, I need it to warm up. So I can actually wear this somewhere and then the last thing that i got i don't know if i ever ordered jewelry from fashion nova before all right y'all so i already have the dupe bottega earrings and i seen that um fashion nova had this dupe bottega necklace which i just feel like i need another gold necklace because all the gold necklaces that i have are either like broken or they're like necklaces that you can't wear every day and i feel like this would just be like a cute little accent to some of my outfits but yeah i feel like this would be so cute with my little earrings just when i want a little extra pop a little statement piece i like this would be really cute so yeah um i also picked that up now that is all the packages that i had to show y'all and i'm kind of freaking sad because i just cleaned up my room and now i have all this stuff on my bed stuff over here stuff over here all right so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and put all this trash up and put all this new stuff that i just got up and then when i come back we're gonna go ahead and plan for the month it's actually already april 5th but i need to plan for the month i really have a pretty good idea like my content and stuff but i really do want to like just start being more prepared so i know like what's coming up because sometimes i feel like i don't prepare mentally and so when things come up i'd be like overwhelmed and super anxious but i feel like if i like give myself an idea like okay you have this coming up this coming up this coming up i won't be so like oh my god the whole point of me plan is just to be a little bit more prepared april is going to be such a busy month for me so it's like essential that i plan so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and put all this stuff up and then we're gonna get into planning Am I really So as y'all can tell, I done got ready for bed and everything. Um, I did go ahead and plan out my content and the things that I know of, like events and plans that I have for April. I feel like you don't really know stuff until like it comes like a week or two before. But as far as like the first two weeks in April, I do know my plans. So I went ahead and wrote that down as well. But I do feel pretty good about my content. I pretty much have, have all my videos figured out, but I want to do an extra video this month. So that one bonus video, I'm not sure what that's going to be yet. But I do know what the rest of my content is going to look like. So I'm super excited. 
And I don't know, I just feel like I have, like, I have a better start to my month knowing what to expect and, like, what I need to handle and everything. So, yeah. I really hope that y'all enjoyed this video, even though it was a little dragged out. Hope that y'all enjoyed spending the last few days with me being productive and getting things done. I thought like you have to have these type of days when you just get a lot done so that you can relax during the weekend or whenever you have time to just kind of decompress and just chill. So, now that I got all this stuff done, I can really enjoy my weekend in peace and not have to worry about doing X, Y, and Z. So, I'm really glad I got everything done. Hope this video motivated you to be productive and to cross off some things off your to-do list. If you enjoyed this video, make sure that you give it a huge thumbs up. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already and leave a comment below. Thank you so much for watching my video and I will see y'all in my next one. Bye! My baby is so sleepy, y'all. She's so sleepy. She's fighting it so bad so I know she's gonna sleep in tomorrow but she